Welcome to Op Manager Tech videos. In this video, you will learn how to monitor processes in Op Manager. Monitoring system resources such as CPU and memory utilization as well as setting up alerts to be notified on unhealthy utilization levels cannot completely guarantee optimal server or application performance. To understand the source of the load on system resources clearly, administrators also need to know about the performance of each critical process associated with the application or services running on the server. Op Manager helps administrators remotely monitor and manage processes that are running on the discovered devices. To add a process template, navigate to settings and select processes under monitoring. Click add to add a new process template. Select the device from which you wish to discover the processes and choose the relevant protocol. The credential associated with the device is displayed. You can either use the associated credential to connect with the device or use credential library and select the appropriate credential from the available list. We will choose associated credential for this demo. You can also create a new credential by clicking the add credential button. Click next. All the processes that are currently running on the device will be listed along with their ID, name, path and arguments. Select the required processes that need to be monitored. Click save and associate. Then select the devices on which these processes need to be monitored. Click save. The selected processes are now associated successfully and available as templates. You can also set resource thresholds for the process monitors. Once a resource CPU or memory utilization by a process exceeds the configured threshold, an alert is triggered. To configure this, click a process name. We will select postgres.exe for this demo. Configure the threshold values for CPU and memory resources. In the consecutive times field, enter the value of how many consecutive times the threshold can be violated before the alert is generated. Configure the process instance count. So, an alarm is triggered if the number of instances on the monitored device exceeds the threshold value. Click Save and Associate and save the configuration. The threshold value for the selected processes has been configured successfully. We hope this helped you learn how to monitor processes in Op Manager. That's it for now. Thanks for watching. To stay up to date with the latest videos exploring Op Manager's features, subscribe to our channel, Op Manager Tech Videos.